Hello guys, this is the travel landing page with background video and carousel effect. Okay, you can see it automatically navigate to next page after eight second. Okay, you can see on the screen. Yeah, that's it. Okay, uh, today we are going to build this uh, landing page with carousel and uh, this beautiful nav bar. Okay, which contain logo and some nav item with home about destination blog gallery and contact okay and here you can see some hero tag title description and button okay you can click to navigate to next page yeah you can see this is it okay then let's go and build this beautiful landing page okay guys uh, let's see the file structure okay i have uh, these three file okay first this image which uh, collect video and image okay this one thing to the video okay this is the video and i use uh, i download this video from mixkit.com okay here you can find lots of free video okay and this is index list then instant sizes okay let's jump to the vs code and i have already created some Starter file okay, and this is style okay. I am using font Noto Sans for the font family. Uh, this and this okay. Let's go and write a code. Let's go. Then first we need main section okay. To main section okay. Then we will have first never never section okay. Then we will have casual casual hero section. Arrow six. Okay. Then we will have carousel indicator indicator section. Okay. Uh, let's uh, start the map. Okay. First of all, we need to for logo. Okay. For logo. Okay. Okay. We will have this travel class will be logo. Then we will have uh, nap tag. Okay. We will have like, okay. Nap tag. Then we will press class will be active. Okay. Let's press uh, shift alt and down key for the application. Then click active and control D and okay. then remove it. Okay. Then about the destination destination then block gallery gallery and contact okay next about destination destination block gallery and contact okay okay this is another item let's see the browser you can see uh, let's install the number first okay we will have first of all main section main section okay dot main will be 100 percent that will be 100 ps overflow will be given push will be left okay nav bar okay nav bar section okay then we have nav with 100 percent that's auto Background will be when we use RCB, okay? 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 2, 5. Like, okay, backdrop for the Google effect, okay? Well, we need to picture for that. This will be flex, right? And this is why content. So, this is video, okay? Then we'll have some padding, okay? Padding, top and bottom, then they can write it. Then, person will be absolute. Uh, top will be 0, left will be 0, and this is okay? 9999. Yeah, that's a little bit better, okay? Navigate to, yeah, that's a little bit better. Fonts, font size will be 1.5, okay? Other will be a stack, yeah, okay? Right. Font weight will be input. And I will get to nav here, okay? Nav here. This will be flexed. Then I can see that. Yeah, will be 128. Okay. You can see the gap is totally fine. Nav, you will ally and anchor. Okay. The finish will be 1.1 RAM. Then color will be COCOCO. -C -O -C -O, okay. The color will be 450. Then transition will have some power effect. So that 5 seconds each. Out, okay. Okay, it is fine. Yes. Okay, because. Uh, let's, uh, let's, let's for some time, okay. Let's, let's, okay. Uh, let's find it over here. When you hover on each color, will be that one, okay. And on the active, the active will have one side will be 1.15, which higher, okay. That will be 500. Or maybe, let's check. Our nav bar is completed. Let's move to the error section. Uh, for the error section, we are going to use sweeper js dot com carousel. Okay, go to sweeper js dot com carousel. Go and then navigate to the thumbs gallery loop. Then click on the core core section to get code. Okay, uh, if you click here, you will navigate to the 
code section i already done that then first of all you need to go and copy css from here copy css and paste it on your css file okay paste it here then go to down copy this section okay this all and paste it to here okay that's it and i will change it later okay main section okay from here to here okay Let's paste it here we'll change this later Let's check this out this work yeah this will be perfect let's delete some of file okay i just want only two file okay here two and here also two let's refresh it you can see only two section each uh, uh you can copy the css from here okay according accordingly but i don't want to copy i will try to answer see this i don't need this style sheet okay i don't need this one and uh, here is a two section okay uh, this one is casual section this one is indicator section okay for that we are going to use the hero section in the hero section we are going to paste this one casual section okay paste it here uh, we have another section which is hero casual indicator indicator okay we should contain this section okay let's go and paste it on here we must stop okay maybe there is some here or what you can see it is not everything because we have just changed okay we will work on that i don't need that button to navigate okay let's remove there's some content here. Let's add some video, okay? This is video section, okay? Video section. For video, we don't have source, okay? Then we'll have source, which will contain SRC source. Then first image, then we'll have DG video, okay? Then we'll, we'll have to define type for this, okay? Type will be video by mp4 mp4 okay. mp4 then loop auto auto play muted then place in line and class will be carousel video okay no less of content of okay. here carousel content dot hero content section okay hero content section then first hero data okay hero data then hero tag hero tag will be first circle on then base experience this experience okay and then that's one dot hero title okay title will have go and explore it's it okay then p tag with hero dj's description lower m 20 30 okay below 30 okay then we'll have on button button dot explore btn okay explore now okay oh video is playing but content is not same okay we have to work on that first of all i'm going to make this one this one to 25 okay much better okay. you can see now it's look better we have done with this section uh, let's comment for 
for a moment and let's comment this one for a moment also and we are going to image we are going to this one image here uh, for that uh, we need to image section uh, from slash image then bg1 okay here is the indicator is not showing okay uh we are we are going okay one closing deep okay. all right guys we have done on the html section okay let's go and start it okay not we have not done it okay we are going to add some here okay free mode true okay then Auto auto play will be delay will be twenty five zero zero then yes disable and clearness with introduction will be true okay we don't need this one then auto play will be here then we need to offer add second all right guys we have to with the html file let's go and install it from okay hero section okay third hero section okay hero section which will be 100 percent as will be 100 100 ph background will be linear gradient okay linear gradient 2 right direction color will be 0 comma 0 comma 0 comma 0 0.75 or 25 okay then again rgb okay 0 comma 0 0 0 0.25 same as the okay then arrow section dot super slide okay uh, you can see super slide is here this one is super slide okay person will be related double will be 100 person as will be auto text align will be center then a font size will be 18 pixel background will be rgb not 25 we will have one okay then display flex align item center jcc justify content now let's start the video section okay to error section to error to error video okay uh, this one is just coming from here okay this one okay this one okay it will be 100 percent as will be auto z index will be one now you can see content displayed on the right section okay for responsive okay for video responsive okay let media not screen minimum aspect ratio will be 16 by 9 where dot hero section dot casual video will be w will be that person as will be auto okay now for maximum okay maximum will be which will be auto then it will be that person okay and we have to change minimum to max then zero contain six and opt okay zero contain section okay which will be hundred percent that will be hundred years background will be I'm just I'm going to copy it from here okay just gonna copy it from here to save the time okay time and is good for health uh -huh. 
just 60 and then 15 <coughs> person absolute okay background position top will be zero left left will be zero z index will be one display flex line item center jc as it start then adding the 80 pixel okay yeah yeah okay why did it come here because we have then dot we have hero data which will contain max width will be 55 percent okay height will be auto back draw back draw filter will be blur 3 pixel then border radius will be 6 pixel display flex a align item flex start okay not center okay jc as the step one thing start and fld column heading will be 20 pixel yeah and you can see little bit of blur effect on the content background okay then dot arrow data dot arrow tag okay fns will be 1.1 one 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 rim this will be 500 color will be as tag ffc okay padding will be 5 pixel from top and bottom 10 pixel from left and right Two five five for some white background. Okay, zero point two. Okay, then border radius will be four pixel. Okay, then display flex AIC center JCC center column gap will be zero point three rem. Then MB will be zero point five rem. Okay, like okay, okay dot hero tag hero tag dot oh, maybe you know this one okay circle for that total will be 6 pixel that will be 6 pixel border radius will be 50 percent then background will be f f let's take f f f c c okay that's it let's look okay that's good okay then but hero title title okay font size will be 4.0 rem okay totally bold bolder okay color will be as check if you okay mb will be 1.5 rem then text align will be left nice go and explore it's okay the standard hero description will be text align will be left then fns will be 1.5 frame then the font weight will be 400 color will be hashtag 9f 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 okay line height will be 1.5 frame Okay, margin will be 2.01 rim. Let's look, yeah, it look good. By the way, let's install the button now. Explore button. Explore button, okay. Which will be 150. Height will be 43. Then background will be as tag 00A36C. Outline will be none, border will be 2 pixels solid. Okay, RGB, RGB, 0, 163, 0, Okay, border rest will be 6 pixels, not 6, 4 pixels, okay. Font size will be 1.1 rim. Okay, color will be hashtag FFC. FFC okay. First of all, the pointer transition will be 0.5 second. It's out. Let's look how it looks like. Okay, that's good. 
let's add some power effect on the bottom okay then while on hover now we need to add this one uh background will be transparent transparent this one then color will be let's check this okay wow you should look better now yeah all well, it's done okay we have done with the this one okay this one let's go and install this one indicator section position will be absolute r will be five percent right five percent but um ten percent which will be 50 percent height will be 200 pixel then float not left right okay let's see it is came here let's study it okay dot local indicator dot swipe for slide slide will be filter brightness will be 50 percent Okay, okay, then arrow as indicator dot swiper wrapper. wrapper. Okay, this one. Okay, this one which will contain with 100% or to display flash. C, 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 E, N, then that will be one point two ten. Then overflow. We have judge my swiffer dot swiffer slide thumb active. Okay. This is default class which we can get from here. Okay. This one, okay. This one, okay. Filter will be brightness will be 150 percent. Ah, that's it active okay sweeper slide image okay that will be 120 i told 150 pixel then object fit over border radius will be 6 pixel then mb will be 0 okay it's active as well and still for for and there is some error okay there is some error because of this okay because of this this was appear okay now let's look uh, this looks good okay uh let's add some other pages okay i will do it myself and do yourself okay just just then uh, select uh shift alt and down arrow I'm going to make it to uh, four time okay first section uh, and then we'll have each one okay then flower flower experience flower okay I think so then then bg will be second uh, which is about what experience watching okay watching the answer Adventure, okay. Now add some image as well, okay. Multiple time, okay. This is second, this is third, this is fourth, okay. This one, okay. Oh, there is some mistake, okay. Then we have to go in for slide four, not four, five, six. Then it's just between the two, okay. That's it. Now you can see, it looks very good. Wow, did it look cool, okay. Let's add some uh, uh, carousing effect, okay? For that, while scrolling, you can see it is uh, swipe uh, right to left, okay? We are going to uh, fade it out, okay? For that, we'll have 
effect property and super chess okay effect will be fed okay now you can see wow this looks better now nice that's it guys if you love this then give thumbs up subscribe and uh, press the bell notification bell okay support me guys okay share as much as you can